Decided to come out for a wee, a wee bushcraft breakfast. So, what we're going to cook on? I brought the wee one tigress uh, rubicoid stove. Not the new one, the old one. Uh, I've got my what part have I got? I've got the Petromax SP32. Trust the old SP32. It's a great pan. Absolutely fantastic for cooking in. So I'm going to cook a wee uh, bushcraft breakfast, so stay tuned. So, you want to this rubicoid stove, great wee bit of cap, very very handy. Just the way we want to, for a tiny wee kind of fire, just comes in there. A few wee bits, all slots together. Side sections go on first. Right. You probably see the cut off the guard before, but it really has. So handy you got cut. Just if you want to, to dive out. Get a wee bit of cooking outside, and obviously it doesn't leave any any marks on the ground, etc. But you can see how easy it, it goes together. Last but not least, these sections in the top. Right, boom, ready to go. Pan wise, let us say, Petromax SP32, wrought iron pan, really is. I use this all the time, as you can probably tell for most of my videos, but really is, it's a fantastic pan. So, that's what I'm using. Uh, let's say, one tig this Rubicoid stove, so we're going to fire that up and then let's get cooking. Stove on, so next up, what are we cooking? Right, I've got some mushrooms cut up, two fried eggs, some bacon, uh, some cheese, and four of these kind of potato kind of pancakes, plus a couple of rolls just to chuck it all into. So I think it's time to get the, the pan on, get some oil into it, and get it cooking. Right, first in, I'm going to stick the potatoes. So, 
So these literally are just, it's just mashed potato, a bit of salt and pepper, and then you just kind of flatten them down into kind of pancakes. Right, we'll start frying them off first. Right, they're coming along. Next up, cheeky couple of bits of bacon. You know you love that several times. Next up, the mushrooms. Put them in the corner. Right. Last but not least. Well, not quite last but not least. A couple of fried eggs. Lovely. Right folks, it's a pure disaster there. Things tipped over. I lost some of my breakfast. No good. But anyway, let's stick some cheese on the top. Why not, eh? Typical, huh? had to be me. I spills half the breakfast. Well, not quite half yet. I lost an egg. So, I'm just gonna have to make do with what's left in the pan. But I'll still manage to squeeze a couple of rolls out of it. So, it'll be all be good. But it's left still looking pretty good, so. Oh, it's just a bit ready actually. I reckon it's time to, I reckon it's time to just chuck that in a couple of rolls, what do you think? Good to go? I'd say so. Right, bacon first. That one can have an egg, the other one's going to have to do without. Right, fried potato. I'll just make that a, a double. That one can have the mushrooms. Looks good to me. Right. Oh yes. Right, taste test time. Oh. Spot on. That'll do me. Right, roll's done in. Lovely. Time for a brew. Oh, I can't believe I lost that egg. Good. In fact, I really, I nearly lost the whole breakfast, and that would have been an absolute disaster. But I saved the majority of it, so it's all good. That's it. The machine is fed. So I'm going to get back out uh, tonight. I think I might take the hammock tonight. So, I reckon, I don't know, hammock and a beach camp, I think. I don't know why, I just, I feel as if that's what's going to happen tonight. So, I'm going to get the hammock eh, and head down a beach beachfront location. So, 
hopefully you'll tune into that one as well. That should be good. Don't know what the weather's to be like tonight. Hopefully it's not too windy. I'll take the well. I'm all will be one Tigris night, so I'll take all my one Tigris gear, one Tigris rucksack, one Tigris hammock under blanket, and I don't know what sleeping bag I'll take, but that's what's happening tonight. But the last video, just a wee, just a wee cooking video, a wee bushcraft breakfast in the woods. So hope you enjoyed. Uh, and as ever, if you don't mind, if you like the video. Hit the wee thumbs up, uh, hit subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the bell for future notifications. And last but not least, thanks for watching folks, catch you in the next one, adios.